Okay, so here is a very interesting engine I got from Dampfzauberer. There you go. It's a type of Uniflow engine. It's got two ports, as you can see there, and then a really massive central exhaust. And it's the first time I've run it on steam. And this is, trust me, this is barely ticking over. So if I give it a little bit of extra steam of the uh, Stewart 504 boiler I'm using here. Watch this. This baby has some legs. Fantastic noise as well out of that big exhaust. So, what I'll try to do now is I'll try and reverse it on the full steam. Bit of a risky move, but a little fun nonetheless. Reverse gearing, and there we go, and it self starts. That's how well balanced it is. It's actually a very interesting arrangement because it has two separate slip eccentrics. So you can set the timing for the gear separately and discreetly. And then it's got this big fat crosshead here. And the casting for the cylinder, or I don't know if it's a caster or if it's machined, I suspect it's machined. It is very chunky and very thick so it retains its heat very well. This is one hot puppy. So I'll give it a bit more steam now. And I'll just find the sweet spot in the gearing. Hear that? Reverse it again. There we go. And the other way. Packs a serious punch. That's all I've got. A lovely flyer will as well. I'll just stop the steam to show you. There you go. It's a heavy, heavy beast. Engine weighs nearly five kilos. inlets and exhaust arrangement. Big fat exhaust so uh, I had to put a, a garden hose on it. Stewart valve on the other side. Two drain cocks on the cylinder. There they are. fine running engine. I'm very, very pleased with it indeed. Lots of shiny metal and brass, or bronze I think it is rather. There we go. Oh, the little cracker. And I'll just uh, leave you to admire it for a bit.
Thank you very much. Dampfzauberer.